it going it's a bit of a different camera angle for you today i'm going to be trying to dupe the natasha denona golden palette so i have the original gold as you can see i'm going to try and do it with other natasha denona palettes that i've got and i'm going to try to use big pans so that they you know it looks good in here but i might have to resort to smaller pans so hopefully i can get it near enough like a dupe because I don't want to buy this palette and I think I don't know I've already got all these colours so uh, it, it looks nice I think the only thing about it what's tempting me is the packaging <laughs> I really like the packaging it looks lovely I'm not going to buy this palette so I'm just going to see if I can dupe it anyway so that I'm not tempted so that I can have a go with something that looks pretty much like it and uh, I know I'm going to, I think I'm going to want to put it back to this after a little while because I think it's a bit boring looking without the teals in it. There's nine of them that are in the new palette. So what I'm going to do is take out the ones that are not in it, which is these, and put them in here. I think they're going to fit in there. So I'll do that now. Now I'm just going to um, m remove all these nine and put them in the places where they're supposed to be in the new palette. So they're all out and we're going to put them in the places where they're supposed to go. So it's Mlico first, then Nubia, then Panna, and then Aria. So I've got to find Aria. I keep thinking, should I clean this palette? But I don't care, really. I don't really care. Let's see if I can. I don't think I can clean it, really, because it's the foam. I mean, I can clean in here. So I've got to find Aria because I've got that one. So it's not that one. There it is. So that's Aria. And then you've got Fizzy Varis. That's this one, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's what I'm calling it. I don't know if that's how you say it. Varis, Varis. I don't know. And then we've got Aura Teak. Where's Teak? That's Teak. Carver, is this one Carver? Yeah, so there's Carver. Sandstone, that will be this one, won't it? So there's Sandstone. Uh, Aurum, Log, this one's Log. And Oro, which is the really yellow gold. Sure, that does definitely, yeah, that's Oro. And then we got Flesh and then Alchemist. So why have I got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What one's missing? Oh, it is that one, the Aurum. Why was I thinking that was a new one? So there it is. That's where they are in the new one. Now I'm going to see what I've got in other large palettes that I've got of Natasha Denona's that might look like the missing shades. So first off, I'm going to look at the Bieber. And I'm going to put a little bit of cardboard over the mirror so I don't blind you and be showing you ridiculous things, my ceiling and tripod and all that. So there's that. And I was looking at this one, I think. I'm, I'm not so sure about finding the shimmers, but I think I can find mattes that look a lot like it. I think this one looks like Panna. I think that's how you say it, Panna. Or this one is, what is it? Flesh. Hmm. 
pan is more like a, a browny one and flesh is a bit more peachy. So this tusk could be the right one for panna, even though tusk is not a cream to powder. I'm not going to get a cream to powder in, in these, I don't think. So I'm going to take tusk out. And what other one do I think? I mean, should we have a swatch? Can hardly see it. They don't always swatch good, do they? So there's that. I think tusk could be. I'm just going to poke it out. So there it is, Ben. Poking it out. Have I wrote on that one? I need to write on these or I could lose track of them all. I mean, does that look right next to that? I'm going to write tusk on the back of this just in case. I won't know what it is otherwise. Tusk and zebra. I've just wrote it on there. So there's that. That was the only one I thought of because these are all too dark. But I might be interested in one of these shimmers. So shall I take them out and look at them? I'm gonna try to get this. I'm gonna get shine out. So there's shine wrote on that. Then I'm going to get Monroe out as well, just in case I get really stuck. I don't think this looks like like it very much, but that's what I'm gonna do. And then there's definitely nothing else in there that is going to match, is there? So that one's done. And I'll just write on the back of this. So there's Monroe. So I've got these to consider because one of them pulls peachy and that one is uh, Nubia, I think. Is it Nubia? Yeah, I think Nubia is a peachy, like it's got a peachy shift. So one of these might be good for that. And then I'll show you this one, but I don't think there's anything in it. This is the Leela, and the only one I was thinking was this white one, but I think it's got too much pink in it, so I'll swatch it. But I think that shifts pink, so I'll do it here. And we need a lemon shift, because I've had a good old look at some of them. This one really stuck in my mind, this one here, Aura. And that had a beautiful lemon shift. It was like a stark white shimmer with a lemon yellow shift in it. It was very beautiful. I don't know if I've got anything, but I can see the pink shift in that. I can see that. So it's not that one. So this palette's no good at all because all these pull pink, pinky toned, pinky purple tone. You know, these, these are like cool tone mattes. They, they don't. They don't look anything like it, do they? I thought this one was going to be good as Miko, but it's too yellow. It's like a, yeah, it's a bit yellowy, like a proper goldy toned one. So there's nothing in there. I've got the um, Triochrome, so we'll have a look at that one. Now this one looks interesting for Miko. I think Miko looks more white to look at though. But, um, shall I have a look at it? Let's have a look. That is a possibility, isn't it? Because I'm not going to be that picky. That's like an off-white. So I'm going to get that one out. Vortex. So here comes Vortex. And I think I've labelled this one before, yeah. So that one is already labelled. And then what else have I got? Why am I looking at this one? That is going to be way too dark. I was looking at this one for going there. Let's see what his swatch is like. I think this is going to be too dark. I'm not sure. I think that's too dark, isn't it? But I could get it out. I'll just get it out. I don't think that's it, though. I'm looking on the Natasha Denona website. I've got the... Thing over over there I can see it on the screen so that's that one labelled put that there 
they're all ones I'm just going to consider them when I have a look I don't think there's anything else in there is there that is way too peachy these all pull green there's nothing there so that's that one looked at sorry I'm going to get it in shot better there's nothing else there I've got this massive one here this is the green brown and I love it so I'm going to fold it over and I've got all the names there so one what I was thinking about for Aura is that one what's that one called cream and then there's true gold there but this one looks too silvery I'm going to swatch it I'm not sure it's, it looks like a good, um, I mean, it's definitely looks lemony, doesn't it? But it's lemon in the first place. It doesn't, does it shift white? And then what's this one like? That's cream. It's called cream. Sorry, I'm not holding it in shot. So this one is true gold, isn't it? And that one is cream so let's have a look i really like the look of the top one that was there it was the true gold i think hang on even though it doesn't look right, does it? Then you get, um, see, I'm, I'm gravitating towards cream to look at because that looks more like it. Yeah, that is labelled. So I'll get that one out. This doesn't look like it to look at, but then when I put it on my hand, it does look more like it. And that one's labelled. This one looks interesting for down here. This one. What is this one called? It's called Flamingo, which makes me think it's going to pull pink. That's not too bad, actually. I'm going to get that one out. So there's Flamingo. Let's have a look at this one. What's that one called? Shell. I'm going to get it out. Getting that one out. These shimmers. Nubia is bothering me. Because they look really sparkly. Um, what have I got for Nubia? I keep thinking, I keep looking at all these. Nubia, Fizzy. That one is labelled. So that's Moon, whatever it's called, Moonstone. Got Moonstone, sorry, I wasn't in shot. I took Moonstone out. What's this look like? Wow. That's a good one. That is peachy, isn't it? That one looks nice. I've got to look at the descriptions. So Nubia, sparkling foiled gold nude champagne. And then what's fizzy? Sparkling wet effect golden nude. What is this one? I'll just get it out just in case. Did I, uh, yeah, that one's labelled. I think these are going to be too dark, aren't they? I don't know. What's this one like? Wow, that's a nice gold, isn't it? I think I'm done with that palette. I don't know whether to take Indian gold out. Let's have a swatch of Indian gold again. just going to take Indian gold out just in case I'll take Indian gold out as well I've got these five pans 
I was interested in looking at this one. Ooh, that one looks like it might be good. What's that called? Nude. Kind of like that. I need to label that one. And obviously that's the only one in there. So I've wrote on that one. My chicken scratch writing. <laughs> and then I've got the coral. I know this looks nothing like it, but what about when it's swatched? This end one here. What's that one called? It's called Kai. That is not like it, is it? That's not like it. No, I don't think so. So that's no good. And then there's this one. This is five pan palette. Oh, two. Um, these these two do they pull purple? I think they do. Yeah, they definitely do. But what about this one? And that one's got a nice shift in it. Is that too peachy though? I don't know. I'm just going to get that one out. That one is called Light Coral. Because there's one in there that's a bit peachy looking when it shifts to me. That one's uh, Nubia. Yeah, I wrote on that one. And this is just Shell. Is that right? Shell. And I've already got a shell. There's shell. So I've got two shells. So I don't need that. So have I got what I need to make it look right? Because I've got a lot of smaller palettes, but I didn't really want to be going in them. Because I've got this one. Nothing in there. I was looking at that one. But that shifts pink. So that's no good. And then, of course, if you watch my videos, you know I've got this one, which I'm quite interested in, this here. Let's have a look how that one sh uh, looks, how it shifts. See, that one's interesting to go in the middle, in, in here, Aura, because it's white and it's got a gold shift. I would rather it was more lemony, but I'll just get it out anyway. This does shift gold, not green. So that's called Queen. I don't think that's going to be the right one because I've got it sitting here next to these. This one looks like it in the pan, but then I think this one looks like it when it shifts. So I'm in an R in between the two there. Then we've got this one. I think these all go to too pink when you swatch them. I was thinking these two. But that looks like it's got a pink tinge to it. I think. I swear that's looking... And then when I do it next to this one I already got out, which was Vortex, weren't it? No, that's Flamingo. Oh, this one's Vortex. I think Vortex is... Here it is. Vortex. I think that one's better because that's got a gold tinge to it. This one looks pinky. Yeah, this one's goldy. More gold. So I think I'll leave that that nude mauve's in that big one we already looked at. And then we've got this one. But this is pinky. As well, isn't it? Keep thinking, should I just get them out? I keep thinking I might need to get Vivienne out. I was just cleaning my hand over here. It's getting covered, isn't it? That's got too much of a pink tinge, hasn't it? Doing it again. 
yeah that is too pink when you hold them next to each other it looks too pink so it's not that one there's the yucca um these shift green everything's green in there there's nothing in there then i've got the love now i didn't realize i thought love would be no good but this one does that look pink Where can I do it? Where can I do it, guys? I've got nowhere to do it. They never swatch very good, do they, Matt? Can hardly see it on me. So I'll get I'll get this one out. This one's called First. I prefer to have all the big pans though. And then what about this transparent? Well, I don't know. I'll just get it out. And what about this one? Lifetime. That is so orange looking. Look how orange that is. I don't think that's it, but it does look like it shifts pinky peach, look. Which is what I think one of them does. I can't remember which one it was. Was it Nubia? I'll get it out, but I don't think it's going to be that. And then that one's done. Got the Sendo here. Um, Don't think any of that is it, is it? I was just looking at this one. It's a bit too... Is that a bit too orangey? This one's too dark. But what about this? What does that do? I think that's got green in it. Yeah, they can't can't have that one. It's got green in it. And what's this one? That's too orange, isn't it? So it's not that one. This one might be interesting. Got the glam. That's too grey looking, isn't it? This one's grey looking. I'll pop it out. But I don't think that's it. Don't think that one's it. And then what have we got? I keep thinking Muse um, in my other nude palette is going to be looking like Nubia for some reason. I just keep thinking about it. That one reminds me of the lemony coloured one, but it's not really, is it? I want to try and stick to the big pans, really. Should I get this one out? Don't know if I should be getting this one out. I'll just get it out. It's not going to be that. None of the mats in there look like any of it. So I think that's it. What's this one look like? Too white, isn't it? Hang on a minute. Out you come. Just checking it's labelled. So I think that's it. Is it? What's this one? That is silver looking, isn't it? That is way too silver. So that one's done. Then I've got this one. Don't think there's anything in there. What's this one here? No, I think I can see green in that. I 
And that is not it. That's not it, is it? Oscar. Not you, Oscar. It's not you. Do you think I should just pop... Should I pop Oscar out? Oh no, that doesn't look right, does it? I don't think. So I think we're done with that one, aren't we? And then last but not least, the beautiful mood. I love this one. See, look at that. That reminds me of Nubia so much. I'm going to get that one out. Because I really like that one. This is really, really sparkly as well. I have to label that because I'll forget. Then what else have we got? This nude one. Oh, look, we've got this off-white looking one. That one's called Bear. And I keep eyeing up this one. Sheen. Beautiful Sheen. That is beautiful, isn't it? I like that one. And then what about this? That's not right. Don't know. What about that one? I think these are too cool toned, aren't they? I think they're too cool toned. Like they're peachy, they're not really. I don't think those are it. So I think that's it. So that's all of them. Now I've got to decide which ones out of these make the thing up. I really like this one for the corner. That one, that's Vortex, isn't it? Vortex, kind of like Vortex for there. Because all of the other, I want one that pulls a bit more yellowy looking. And I think this pulls to, this is pink, look at it. Pink. And then what else did I have? Oh, this one, I pulled that one out. And this one, that looks way too pink now, doesn't it? That is way too pink. So that isn't right for that corner. I think this one's the right one. But unfortunately, it's not a cream to powder. But I think that's the more the right shade. So I'm going to put that in there. And then what's next? Nubia. That just makes me think of news. But I really didn't want to be putting that size in there. But it is very sparkly, isn't it? Like it. Wow. And then what else looks like the same? Because I'd rather put a big one in. What's this one like? Doesn't really look anything like it, does it? Okay, I'm looking at these now. What have I got here? So Mlico is definitely... Like it even pulls a little greyish in these swatches. I think that's the right one. That's the right one. Out of the big shades. I'm kind of looking at this one now. What is this one? Glam. Transition. That's glam. And that's transition. Is that right? No, that's... This is the Vortex, and this is the Glam Transition. Oh, 
I keep thinking it's that one now. Which one was it? There they are. I think it's this one. What one was that? <laughs> I forgot now. Oh dear, what one is it? That one's more yellowy, isn't it? This vortex. It's this one, isn't it? Like, why does that, that looks so grey in the swatches? Now I'm thinking it's that one that goes there. But I don't like it because it's small. And I don't really want these small ones in it. I think I'm just going to, might have to stick with that one. Come on out of the cup. Let's have a look. It's either that one or that one. And then this uh, Nubia, that really does have a peach. I think that one's quite good, this Muse. Even though I didn't want to put a little one in there. Let's see what else there is. I think I had this one I wanted to look at. Where can I even put anything anymore? No, is it? No, it's not that one. I'm going to get rid of that one. That was Monroe, I think. And then what about this one? I think I just like this one. And that's that. That's that. That's what I like. I really don't like that I'm putting these small pans in here though. What else is there? Maybe I could do this this one easier. What was this one called? Flesh. Okay. I think that one looks all right. This is going to be too dark, that one. I think that one's too dark. So is that the closest thing? Yeah, I think I'm going to go with that one in here. What have I got for fizzy? I think that looks quite good for fizzy. I know it's not the same finish, but that might be the one. Is that one? It's more golden, isn't it? So it's not that one. That one pulls a bit pink. That one's pulling a bit pink. It's making me think pink, that one is. What's this? Oh, this was for the, gonna be for there, wasn't it? Yeah, that was for there. That one's not right now I'm looking at it. That is not right. That was a green brown. Oh, that was Indian gold. That isn't right. So we don't want that one. Um, we're getting there, aren't we? I think I'm going to look at the... I think it's this one. Look how lemony it looks. Cream. That goes in there, in the centre here so I'm going to swatch that one swatch that one and swatch this one 
that is too that's got a green tinge in it so it's going to be that one because that looks lemony to me and then am i happy with uh this one over here and i keep thinking i want that one in there I really wanted all big pans because now I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it like that. I know I'll be putting it back to the original. I think the original was better. I don't like that she took the greens out. So this one is fizzy, isn't it? What we're trying to do. Fizzy. I'm pretty much going for the colour. Trying to get the colour in. I'm looking at Natasha Denona's swatches right now. What else have I got? Let's swatch all of these. Uh-uh. It's not that one, is it? That's good. Let's get rid of them and then I won't be so confused. This one's going to be too light and pink. That's too light and pink. What's this one? Has this got a pink tinge in it? That's not going to be fizzy, is it? That's not going to be it. Look, that's silly. That ain't fizzy, is it? Then this one's going to be too... This one's called Skin from the Green Brown. Fizzy, where are you? Nah. I don't think that looks like it so I'll get rid of that this one is shine isn't it is it called shine oh I don't know what it's called but it's from the coral I think or somewhere don't know where it's from now that's not it what about this this one here no I think that is the one, guys. I don't think it looks like it. The palette now. That's not it either. That's the closest I'm going to get to it, I think. I keep thinking, does that one look too pinky in all, in, in all here now? I don't know. Do I want to put this one in there? Because this is just grey looking to me, but it does look grey in her swatches. But I like this one better because it it's more in keeping with the colours in here, isn't it? I'm having that one because I think that one looks better and I wish I could swap that for something else but I think that's the only one I'm gonna be able to do it's quite close to it in the swatches I think I think that's gonna be my finished palette Trying to see if it looks like it. This is a Natasha Denona one. And there's my one. <laughs> Can it fit in there? Trying to get it in. What do we think? I think it looks okay. I'm quite liking that now. Yeah. I think it looks all right. That's a good enough dupe, isn't it? I don't think I'll be buying it. I don't need it. So, yeah, that's my video, guys. That's my dupe. I'll do a, a swatch for you. All on my arm. But I've got to clean it. Look at the state. The state of it. 
I do it on my arm and show you my swatches of my palette I've made. They probably look nothing like it. Probably looks nothing like it when I swatch it. I just thought it'd be fun to do. There's the picture next to it from the Passion Denona's website. That's the picture of her palette. So yeah, right. Let's swatch it, shall we? I think, shall I just leave that there while I'm swatching? Ready? It's hard to see. So there's that one. Can't hardly see it. And this one's supposed to be Nubia. Still looks lovely, doesn't it? <laughs> this is supposed to be Panna. And then we've got Aria. I think that's how you say it. There's Aria. I hope I'm going to fit all these on. Fizzy. That's my fizzy. That's my fizzy, guys. And then we've got... What's this one supposed to be? Varys. Oh, it is Varys, though, isn't it? There's Varys. And then here's my version of Aura. So it's this one. So it's got that lemon shift. And there's that one. What one's that? Teak. That's the real one. That is from the original gold. And then we've got Carver. That is an original. So we've got these ones. I think it's looking quite nice, isn't it? Look at that. Right, and then we've got Sandstone. The sandstone. So now we're starting down here with Aurum. There's Aurum. I mean, people are saying, I have watched a couple of videos, and people are saying these are like really good quality, like better. I think they're like thicker in consistency. These ones have come out thin, they're thinner, which is not necessarily a bad thing. But yeah, people have noticed that they swatch more sheer, like thinner on the skin. These ones are really rich and creamy, you know, from the original gold, the ones that I've got. And then here's that yellow one, which is Oro. Wow. In your face. So that, yeah, that's from the original. Because I've seen some people, they've bought the new one and they've got the gold as well. And you can see the difference in them. The ones from the original look really rich in colour. That's the word I'm looking for. They're very rich looking and opaque and uh, a bit thicker, I think, in consistency. And then we've got Flesh. What, what I hope I haven't chose really wrong here. No, that looks all right. I thought, is this going to look too pink with the rest of it? But it looks fine. So that's my version of Flesh. And then the last one is an original alchemist. So there's my palette, guys, what I've built. I hope I've got the right light for you. I'll, t I'll uh, fiddle about with the light a bit just in case. And then I'm going to change, uh, is that as bright as it goes? I saw something funny in one of those watches for a minute. <laughs> so that's my version, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I'm probably, I'm going to make another video showing all the looks that I create with this one. With my version of the Golden. 
in my big gold palette. So I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you again soon. Like and subscribe. Bye. Thank you.